Uber if you make one mistake. And then he is a big boy damage. Three, two, one. Around. Let me fix go. that very quickly. All right, Cool King's Dark Stalker. That man named Melton at a two, one, one. And Dark Stalker opening it out on the platform. No electrics though. He's looking for the He's mission. Cool King's playing nice and evasive until he tries to land with a nair, and that is a dangerous option in this matchup because landing on Cassian is a risky play. But right now, Cool King's juggling beautifully until you just die. GG's, no read. Oh, he misses the finisher. Doesn't matter. Up B, a laser. See you later. Darkstalker is dead also. Okay, Cool King's. You got a little loose of life right now. You're gonna make a bit. Nice little chain. The Nair is really extending that pressure, keeping the streak going. And nice awareness of the boomerang is coming back there, but flops the combo, and you're gonna eat a lot of damage right now. Again, Darkstalker not hitting the finisher on his combos, but it's still doing a lot of percent. That was never hitting anything random. He will go for that side B off edge every time, and it's uh, you can just hit it. I forget exactly. I believe it has some armor frames. But never mind. One electric, and you are out of here. Darkstalker up right now, and I think it was a missing the F smash. Cool Kings didn't react to do the second hit. A little bit unfortunate on his side. A landing there, so big. Laser just keeping Cool Kings out, and as soon as he gets close, you know what's coming. There's a big boy grab. He whiffs it completely, but that doesn't matter. He has still got it. It's coming any second now. Watch out, Cool Kings. He's gonna do it. Oh, tries to get on stage. There is no raise left, and suddenly this is a good option. But cool Kings goes up low, and Dark Stalker goes high. Oh no, the shield stun messes him up. You hate to see it. It's like when Ganon hits your shield and suddenly he eats all your inputs, but that is an up throw. Kings 106%. Can he close that out? But there comes the command throw. Almost the laser off the top. No down and this time. There it is though. And that is gonna be a game one to Dark wins. And it's, it's just a matter of... Darkstalk wasn't even hitting all of his stuff in that one. There were a few long combos he got to where he didn't land his finish and he could have been dying even earlier. You just have to be very, very careful around uh, Cassia. And uh, no miss inputs either. I think there were one or two moments where Cool Kings ended up flubbing an input right next to Cassia. And that's just a death sentence. But when he got going, Cool Kings was looking good too, so... Uh, we could see him come back in this second game as we think about the stage choice. Think about the music choice. Obviously very important these days to get the right music. Stop the battle! Alright, we're not going to see any character switches here. I wonder if they're going to force uh, Darkstalker onto the Terrier tool today. And if it will go in, I, I imagine he, he wants the money. Money. Three, right, small battlefield two, is the pick. One, Game two. Also, uh, Kings has switched skins. Looking for some early nares again. We were saying in the first game they are kind of it's like a high risk, high reward. Normally there's, there's not much risk in going for leave nair, but versus Casual, there definitely is. But so far the sword is doing real nice until you miss a tech chase, and that's all it takes. One little moment. Nice reaction to get the shield out and the up the out shield electric. He's not landing his electric combo, as you know. I think that was a good option by Cool Kings to go to the platform. Uh, gave him a chance to tech and pick up after two electrics in a row. Cool Kings does punish, and I don't even know what move that was, but he died at 100. That was definitely a Casio moment. No one knows Casio moves apart from that guy's. That Casio moves. Right. Oh, he read the tech option, but again, is flubbing, and you just can't afford to be doing that versus a character like Kazuya. 
offstage situation, but Kazia gets back for free. Still has the command grab. There it is, confirms off and goes for the suicide. Very strong option there coming out from Dark Stalker, and he's got a full stop lead just like that. And lads, electric from behind. That's kind of disgusting. Looks for the wave land that's slightly too far away from the platform. He's still just not getting his combos going. When Dark Stalker does give him an opening, he's not making the most of it. Playing his spacing game nicely. Looking to cover. Oh, huge jump pull out there from Dark Stalker. <laughs> Electric and Ledge is so stupid. What do you do about that? The jump over to the platform, apparently. But never mind. There's Electric into the upbeat, and that is the game. Don't have